How do you send read receipts in Gmail? There's a couple things you need to know about read receipts in Gmail. First, you can only send read receipts if you have a Google Workspace Gmail or if you have an educational Gmail account, so like a Gmail account through your school. And even then, you have to turn on read receipts or have them turned on. And so to do that, there's a link in the description on how to turn on read receipts if you have, for instance, a Google Workspace account. And then to send read receipts, when you're composing your message, in the lower right corner here, we should see three dots that say more options. After you've turned on read receipts for your account, you click on more options and you can request a read receipt. When we click that, it'll check mark this. And so when we send this message, it's going to request a read receipt from the account that you send the email to. It does not 100% work. Sometimes some accounts or uh, email services don't work with the read receipt that's sent. Also, when that user opens up their email, it will request the read receipt. So they have to allow it. And so if they do, then you would be able to see if someone has read that email. But it's kind of a finicky process. I would say that Google's a little notorious for this. Uh, they don't really allow personal Gmail accounts to have read receipts. But if you do have a Google Workspace account, you can turn them on and send read receipts. And you would just send the message like normal. After you've checkmarked, send or request read receipt. So that's how you can send read receipts here in Gmail. If you want to turn them on for your workspace organization, check the link in the description below.